Yeah, Florida State's roster, and I think, you know, Coach Hamilton and his staff do a phenomenal job of recruiting to their style and their system that's built, um, you know, re realistically to withstand, you know, major departures. They have a lot of guys in the last five years that have went to the NBA. They lost two first-round lottery picks off last year's team. Um, and Vassell and Pat Williams, and, and Williams didn't even start. And uh, um, they're stunning. I think they stun you when you look at them. From top to bottom, it's got to be one of the biggest teams in college basketball year in and year out, not just inside, but their perimeter guys are all very, very uh, physically uh, gifted, you know, long, athletic. And, and that's, what, that's what they do with their system. They bring 10 to 12 players a game. They're able to use their depth and their physicality over the course of the game to pressure you and wear you down. And, um, you know, clearly um, that's what they're, they're built to do. And um, you don't see very many teams like it. I think Texas um, was very, very uh, athletic and very physically strong inside. I don't know if Texas's guards are as big as um, Florida State's over the course of, you know, the, 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 the depth. But I think Texas gave us a real hard time in and around the basket. And Texas gave us a real hard time of just making, making things easy on us with their athleticism, their length and their talent. And, um, you know, we had to learn a hard lesson that day about, you know, being able to, you know, be good at what we're doing and be stronger with the ball, be stronger in our execution. Um, this game um, is even a little bit different than that one because, you know, it's underneath out of bounds defense. It's, it's full court pressure on makes and misses. It's, it's side out of bounds pressure. It's in the half court when you cross half court, it's pressure. It's constantly on top of you in terms of not allowing you to do what you want to do. And most coaches that you'll talk to, um, you can pretty much scrap 95% of what you do on a daily basis because it doesn't work against them. So you have to go in there uh, with a different mindset and a different game plan. And playing them a year ago, uh, I think – you know, gives the returners probably an indication of the, the, the you know, how good they are. Um, but, you know, last year's game, um, if you remember, was just an incredible environment in Assembly Hall. There was a lot of juice in the building. There was a lot of adrenaline um, that night. And, you know, that won't be the case as we go down there, um, you know, to have that type of advantage that we had a year ago in our home building. So um, we'll have to go down to a place they're very successful. But um, to me, this is, uh, you know, I know they'll be ready. You know, they haven't really played a lot of games, maybe just one game so far. So to me, they got to be chomping at the bit to play against a team like ourselves coming in the door.